Hey YouTube, I thought I'd talk about something fun that I like to do and that uh, you can do real easily too, and that is making woggles. A uh, woggle is just a, another name for a um, neckerchief uh, slide. Uh, you've probably seen these if you were a kid uh, or you are a kid and you have friends in Boy Scouts or uh, uh, something like that. Uh, it's, it's a slide that you're your neckerchief goes through. Now, I like to make them out of pieces of wood that I find and uh, like this one here for instance that I made that has a has a snake on it. It's just really a, a piece of wood that uh, or a piece of a limb that you've cut and um, so I put a I put a snake on this one. This one I I used a um, kind of a design that I found that uh, Chumash Indians used, uh, some kind of a bug that was interesting to them. Um, same concept, got a hole in it that your uh, neckerchief slide goes through. This one here has got uh, a couple of designs on it. Uh, I used to go to a, a survival gathering called uh, um, Jerk Time. Uh, I don't think they've had one in a few years, but it was a lot of fun. You learned a lot of skills, and this this was their logo, and uh, I just thought it was kind of cool, so I I put it on a neckerchief. And then on the other side here, some of you will recognize this. This is um, from the movie The Revenant, where uh, Jim Bridger is uh, scratching a a snail uh, design onto <coughs> a um, canteen. I just liked it, and I thought, well, that's kind of cool. I'll, I'll, I'll put that on the back side. <coughs> Excuse me. Dry throat. And this one here, this is actually the uh, design uh, belongs to uh, the logo of the um, uh, county park organization that I belong to. It's a couple of foothills and an acorn and some oak leaves and a shoreline. And uh, so sometimes I, I wear that when I'm working. So couple ways to wear this you got your uh, you got your neckerchief we'll unfold this here okay a little windy out here today so let me see if I can adjust this up So one thing you can do is wear it in a triangle around your neck to shade your neck from the sun. Um, keep the sun off your neck. One of the ways, and I do that sometimes, but uh, one of the ways that I wear it most often is starting with the, uh, the point here, is to roll it up. So I get kind of a, a long band like this and I like to soak it in water cold water I'll just go over to a stream I work on trails a lot and I'll go over to the stream and just uh, dip it in water and saturate it and then put it around my neck and I just draw the the tails through the woggle And there you have it. You can just wear it around your neck. And that cold water will uh, keep your neck cold. I know they make commercially available uh, neckerchiefs that have a some kind of a proprietary uh, substance in them that stays cold for a long time. I've used those. They're okay, but they're a little slimy. I'm, I'm not real fond of them. Uh, I would rather just... Uh, have a nice wet cool cloth. I can take it off and mop my face if I want. I can't do that with the uh, chemical um, cooled um, neckerchief. Uh, you see construction workers and road workers with them a lot. I've used them. I, I'll take and freeze it overnight in the freezer and then when the day gets hot I'll take it out of my uh, igloo box and 
put around my neck. But uh, generally when I'm out hiking and like that, I like to keep the sun off my neck. And at some point I'm probably going to get hot and it's nice to just put a cool rag around your neck, mop your face off, maybe um, wring some water out over your head and cool off and then just saturate this and wear it around your neck. So, you know, it's just something fun you can do if you find a branch and you want to have some fun. You can, I, I would burn these designs uh, onto uh, my woggles. Um, you could carve them. I've seen people, uh, scouts carve them with, um, oh, I don't know, uh, like totem pole designs or Indian heads. Um, you know, you name it, arrowheads. You're only limited by your your imagination of uh, what you could uh, what you could make. So, yeah, you know, if you're out there, uh, or maybe you're pruning a branch in your yard, and if it's a nice piece of uh, hardwood, um, make a woggle. It's just uh, great fun. Okay, just a little video for today, and we'll talk to you later. Take care. Thank you.